Celebrate the season with a 15-minute fast creamy pasta dinner, mushroom and cashew cream pasta. It only takes a handful of ingredients. Your market best mix of mushrooms, a few shallots, some garlic, a bit of lemon juice, and cashew cream or sour cream. Put the water on to boil for the pasta and let's get started. Brush away any bits of dirt and roughly chop or thickly slice your mix of mushrooms. The more variety, the deeper the flavor. Mushrooms are a rich, low-calorie treat full of fiber, protein, and antioxidants. And they taste so meaty, I never miss out on that umami flavor I sometimes crave. I like to save the tougher stems to freeze and add to sauces another day. If you're finding value in this video, please give it a thumbs up. It really makes a huge difference to know you're enjoying it. Mince two to three shallots, and if you don't have them, onions make a fine substitute. Mince or press two cloves of garlic. I'm using frozen cloves from this year's harvest. Finally chop some fresh parsley for the garnish and start cooking your pasta while we prepare the sauce. Add two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil to a large saute pan over a medium high heat. Now start with the more delicate mushrooms first, tossing and stirring until they develop a nice brown color and then remove them to the side. To avoid burning any bits, refresh the pan with a little bit of water and a touch more olive oil. Now add the firmer mushrooms and a pinch of salt. Stir and cook down until they're glossy and brown. Make a little space in the middle and add the garlic and shallots. Let them get tender and fragrant as you gently stir it all together. The fresh acidic flavor of one tablespoon of lemon juice really brings things into balance. Now return the delicate mushrooms to the pan and remove it from the heat. Add one quarter cup of cashew cream or sour cream and enough pasta water to thin the sauce to your favorite consistency. I'm a new fan of cashew cream, so I just can't get enough of it. If you want to make it too, I have a short video that I'll link in the description below. I'm adding three ladles full of pasta water to blend the mix into a totally creamy, saucy finish. It's ready to serve with hot pasta and a sprinkle of parsley and a smattering of freshly ground pepper. And for more healthy recipes that help you learn to eat the Mediterranean way every day, please click here and thanks for watching.